Hello, beloved. I hope you guys are doing well. I'm taking a break, vacation. I'm celebrating with my husband our 40th wedding anniversary here in Arizona, right outside Sedonia. And so today I just wanna briefly encourage you to take time to look over your past and see all the great things God has done in your life. Not just counting your blessings, but how he saved you and rescued you from things and turned things into your favor. That's all I want to encourage you to do today. So just look back. You know, it just reminds me. I look back, I always try to take time. I try to. I don't always do it, but as much as I should. But I try to take time to look back and reminisce on how God has saved me. And when I thought it was the end and the devil wanted me to feel hopeless and I found out that well, God revealed to me, he gave me hope. God revealed to me that there's always hope with the Lord. There's always hope with the Lord. So you don't have to give up. You don't have to give up. Don't give up. Don't quit. Don't give up. Just keep going. And whatever you're going through, God is going to turn to your favor. Because God is awesome and magnificent. Look at this beautiful planet he created for us. This is so beautiful. This is a trail. I'm in Oak Creek. And so I like coming to places like this to take a breather relax and it just reminds me of God his presence in my life and how much he cares for us his creation So this is beautiful. God is beautiful. And God is loving. He loves you. No matter what you're going through, He's going to turn it into your favor. Just like with my wedding, my marriage, I mean, been married 40 years this week, that I didn't think it was going to last this long. Not because I didn't love my husband, but Satan is busy, always doing things. And so... But God turned it into my favor, my husband's favor too, and he worked it out for us. You know, a three score, three chord strand is not easily broken. A three chord strand is not easily broken. A three chord strand is not easily broken. And so God can do some wonderful things in our lives. We just have to let him. And if you you don't have a strength, just ask him to help you. Just say, Jesus, save me. Say, save me, Jesus. I need you now. Just say, save me, Jesus. And he will. He'll come to your aid. He'll come to your aid. Okay, so I just want to encourage you today to not give up and to keep your hope. Stay hopeful, optimistic, positive. God's going to work it out for you. And just look back over your life and see the amazing things he's brought you through. Okay, so that's why I encourage you. Okay, chat with you later. Bye-bye.